This is CBS 2 News, 10 at 10. The Cedar Rapids City Council tonight approved one and a half million dollars in extra funding so a long-awaited project can finally begin. We lost the Time Check Recreation Center to the floodwaters of 2008. Replacing the popular facility on the northwest side has taken years and now additional tax dollars. CBS 2 News reporter Matt Hamill joins us now with the details. Matt? Yes, Scott and Tiffany, we are at the future site. We're talking about a price tag now in today's dollars of about four and a half million. Now, FEMA will pay for about half of that, but it says it won't pay for the fights, the delays, or the changes. We're out of time, in my mind, to get this done and get our money spent. After the flood, the battle over where to build a new Northwest Recreation Center was epic, not approved at the old time check site, nor at the Ellis Park maintenance area. But now that it's going to be built next to the historic Harrison School, FEMA forced the council to kick in an extra $1.5 million to make changes. All those in favor say aye. I was opposed they know the motion carries. So they asked us to make sure that what we do complements their facade of that school, which we think is a great idea. Sure, it comes with a cost. We asked FEMA to help fund it. Unfortunately, the feds did what the feds do. Left says using flood sales tax dollars is very appropriate for the rec center that will include a full-size gym and facilities for kids, seniors, and those with disabilities. Doesn't matter all of the ordeals that we went through to get to this point. Even those who fought for other locations thank the council for never giving up. We've got to have that done. And I didn't like the location, but I'm done with it. I lost that battle, let's move on. It's so needed right now, this minute, tonight, that kids need a place to go. And therefore, it can't be built soon enough as far as I'm concerned. It should have been many, many months ago. Back live next to Harrison School tonight, the city will sit down with an architect in the next few days to work out a final design for the Northwest Rec Center, and they hope to have shovels in the ground actually building it by next summer. Covering the corridor tonight in Cedar Rapids, Matt Hamill, CBS 2 News, 10 at 10.